Hey, Hillside. Well, in our Monday night Bible study, we've been looking at Psalm 119. And this one uh, is from a couple weeks ago, the verse I'm going to talk about. But um, first, just the whole psalm is really just focusing on the laws of God, the commands of God, and the psalmist's desire to not only learn them and to follow them, um, but also this kind of shifting the idea from instead of seeing the law and the commandments as a burden to really delighting in them and finding comfort in God's law. And when we were reading through uh, last week, I believe it was, in verse 52, um, he writes, When I think of your rules from of old, I take comfort, O Lord. And uh, some other translations instead of rules here say laws. So this idea of when I think of the rules or the laws, I find comfort. And um, at first that kind of struck me as weird. I was like, oh, well, who likes rules? Or Some people do like rules, though, I realized. Some people find comfort in having those guidelines and laws um, placed out. But, all, but a lot of people also just, you know, see rules and laws as all these like, burdensome things you have to follow. And um, why would you take comfort in having a bunch of rules put on you? And... I thought about how laws, um, the when in the translations where it uses the term law, how we come to see the word law, right? We kind of think typically of the governmental form of laws um, that govern our nations or whatever that, um, you know, states, um, localities. But, um, and, and those things, those laws that we make up, right? We humans create them and they are kind of easily broken. Um, they don't necessarily always get uh, enforced or uh, instituted correctly or evenly in the same ways. Um, there's flaws in that system, right? But then I thought, um, my scientific brain came out and I thought about a scientific law or a law of nature, right? These things are like gravity, for instance, is a, a, a natural law. And these laws, right, are... Um, physical like observations they are they they can be observed right so we see gravity and it's tested again and again and every time right proves to be true this thing it's a repeated incidence and um it cannot be broken cannot be changed we can't influence it um so this idea that it stands right and it's forever and um tangible observed and that that is more like god's laws right god's laws are more like scientific laws in that well he did create the laws of nature right those are some of his laws uh and so this idea that they are firm they are unchanging they are observable and that is comforting right the fact that not necessarily having to follow the rules but this idea that God said them, therefore I know that they are true. I know that they are going to stand, that they will uh, be observed. Um, and that, I think, is where the comfort comes in, right? Not knowing, like, oh, is it going to be done fairly? Is it going to be always the same? Um, like human laws, no, these laws are firm. So, uh, today, hopefully, um, you know, look up some of God's laws, some of God's commands, and find comfort in knowing that um, that they are true no matter what, always, and um, they will stand firm. So awesome. Have a good one, guys.